Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel and in this video I want to show you how to update the Wattpad app on your Android phone. The process is very straightforward and simple so let's just get straight into it. So first of all what you need to do is open up the Google Play Store like I had open. Then at the top search bar all you need to do is type Wattpad. Just like that it will auto populate there you can tap on the first result. Now, when there is an update for Android apps, instead of saying open, it says update. For me, I don't have an update at the moment, so it says open. But if you have an update, all you need to do is tap on the update button. It will begin downloading the update automatically for you. And then when the download is finished, it will then install the update onto your phone. And then you'll be able to use the latest version of the Wattpad app. Now, if that seems a little bit tedious and you don't want to go in every single time and manually update the app, what you can do is you can just go back to the homepage of the Google Play Store, then tap on your profile icon at the top right hand corner. Then you want to tap on settings. From here, you want to tap on network preferences. And then you can see an option there that says auto update apps. Tap on that option. Now you have three different options. It says over any network, over Wi-Fi only, and don't auto update apps. So the one that I highly recommend that you select is over Wi-Fi only, because if you're playing like a lot of games or something and you select over any network, then that's gonna use up a lot of your data and you don't want to do that. So just to be safe, I suggest selecting over Wi-Fi only. Then every time you're on a stable Wi-Fi connection and you have updates available for any one of your Android apps that you installed with the Google Play Store, then it will automatically update them for you without you having to manually check if there's an update and everything like that. It will just happen in the background automatically. So select over Wi-Fi only, then click on done and then you're all good to go. You can go back, you can download more apps, you can do anything that you want, and that's basically all there is to it. So I hope this video helped you out. If it did, don't forget to drop a like onto this video and subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.